what's missing. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, oh, Jada, what's missing? <laughs> Welcome to Ride Ideas with Susan. Today the kids and I have a very simple game to share with you that you can play at Christmas and it's called What's Missing? So first I'm going to share with you what you need for the game and then the kids and I are going to show you how to play it and then at the end of the clip I have some extra ideas for you. Well, let's get started. Lots of objects that have to do with the Christmas story. Okay, you see them there? Yep. What I'm going to do is I am going to turn the box around and I'm going to hide one of the objects and I'm going to ask you to tell me which one's missing. So you got a good look? Wait, you got a good again? look? Who's that? It's Mary. Mary. Who's that? That's a shepherd. Okay, I think how many objects do we have? One, two, three, four, five, six, ten, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, we have ten. ten. Okay, I'm going to turn it around and I'm going to hide one of them away. No peeking. No peeking. Let's see. Now, don't say it out which if you think you know which one's missing, but if you think you know which one is missing. Ooh. Okay, which one do you think is missing? The wise man. You are right. Can you tell me something about a wise man? Um, they brought Jesus, frankincense, myrrh, and gold. Yes, that's right. They brought gifts for Jesus. Okay, well done. Now let's see. That was hide hard. a different one. I know. <laughs> really okay, okay. Them around. Hands up if you know which one is missing. I know. Ooh. Oh, uh, oh, what's missing? The angel. Yes. Tell us about the angel. What does the angels have to do with the Christmas story? Um, well, they appear to Mary. Joseph yes, yes, and, yes, and the shepherds. And the shepherds too, that's right, you're right. Okay, so we got the angel. Okay, what or who is missing or what? Oh, oh, oh. Wait, Joseph. Yes, can you tell us something about Joseph? Joseph? What we know about Joseph? That he was father of Jesus. Yes, he was a stepfather of Jesus. And what did Joseph want to do when he heard that? His fiance was kind of a baby. He wanted to um, cancel the wedding. Yeah, he wanted to cancel the wedding, but what? Why did he change his mind? Because an angel told him in his dream. That's right. Changed his mind. That's right. An angel told him in his dream to go ahead and marry Mary. Does anyone, does anyone want to take over and pick one? Wait, oh, can we step it up and take two? Okay, put two, that's a good idea. What did you think of that little game? Did you like it? Make sure you give it a thumbs up. I saw that game about 20 years ago. I saw a Sunday school teacher do it and I thought, wow, that is a fantastic game. It gives you a chance to review the story. It also gives you a chance to do more teaching. It's interactive. The kids love it because it's a game. So it's been really helpful in my ministry. Now, if you'd like more simple game ideas, I actually have a playlist that I've started with lots more game ideas. And if you want some Christmas lesson ideas, I also have a Christmas lesson ideas playlist as well. And if you'd like more simple ideas like this and you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe, tap the bell, and you'll be notified whenever I put up a new clip. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.